And what fear is doing to you and what fear does to us, right, is it make us overlook our victory like we never have one, right? And it, what it does is it takes away your victory because it has you looking at your secondary, not your primary. Dre, what are you talking about? Bring your whole mind. I just explained to you, most people are stuck in a circle because they are afraid to make a decision. Why? Because they're afraid to fail if they make the decision. You hear me? Bring your whole mind. They don't understand that the objective is to get the fuck out of the circle. That's the objective. Break the fucking cycle that you've been in 5, 10, 15, 20 years. That's the goal. So your fear got you thinking that if I make a decision and fail, fear got you feeling like the decision you make has to have your perception of success. Your perception, right? Not the real truth of success. The real truth of success is the decision being made to break the circle. Because once you make once you make the decision, guess what? New information, new circumstances, everything happens new. Because it's the decision that brings the change. And you need the change because you've been stuck in the circle. See how the mind is? So the objective is not the secondary, right? So you say, you're afraid to make a decision and fail. So the and fail is the secondary. It made you overlook the, the, the success is the decision. It tricked you. It made you overlook the primary and made you go to the secondary. What if I make a decision and fail? The and fail is the secondary. You don't even realize that. What if I make the decision and that's the success? Making the decision is the success because it breaks the circle. And when you break the circle, it introduces you to new information, new opportunities, new vision, new insight. Do you see how that works? Well, that God and that Bible that you have in a struggle believing, that's where I got this information from. And ain't nobody else going to teach it to you. You see what I'm saying? So I said, your problem has never been that you are having a problem believing that the Bible is real, that you're having a problem believing that the, what is the God of Israel? That ain't your goddamn problem. That's how perceptive I am. No, your problem is that you've been dealing with fear all your life and it has immobilized you and isolates you and killed your vision and your dream of your life. And you've struggled with that. And that's OK, because we've all struggled with it. But I need to talk strong to you to bring the man up out of you to make you understand what the real issue is so that you stop being deceived. Right. Well, you tricked into believing that it's something that is not all that shit is secondary. Here's the Bible real and God. All that shit secondary. The primary is you got to deal with your fear. That's the primary. That's what we are dealing with the fear.